everybody, it is me, Alexa, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Nepalese song Asati by Yama Budha. Um, he is a very famous Nepalese rapper who did sadly pass away in 2017 at just the age of 30. Um, I was looking it up before I started the video and was very sad to learn that. I'm excited to take a look at some of his music though, which does live on. He did have quite a few popular hits, um, and I'm excited to take a look at one of them um, that just recommended to me by one of you guys. So thank you all so, so much for recommending this, and yeah, I'm excited to take a look at his music um, and see what it's all about. Alright, so without any further ado, let's jump on in to Sati. Mero baliya kal dekhi ko mille saathi hamlo mitra tha aur us samband banda maathi hami sohar kumna jaanti hu. Rati rati bhagi bhagi ghar ma ama bua lai dhati marna aur marna thayar ek aur kha ko lagi sade sange bostiyo school par da hami Dubai na jaane ye ni yota birami je pani baane hamro ramro thiyo pani usle ek din chulo chal kai sode hoy khane maile pani tane sanko chay na mani din vidhe gayo ni lagi tisko bani bistare khula my first you, Tani Natani, Gaza on the Goti, Saman Rapani, Yo Potito, Tio Potito Dami, Tap no Pitin Pony, Ramre, no Lagnitis, Potti Ferry, Kahile, Ustera Heno Hami, No Hot of Song Gato, Tor of Motor, Tero Song Sona, your monomato, Satur Lita in a Pontio, Kahile, Tora Sati, Nikai, Eklo, Suaile, No Hot of Song Gato, Tor of Motor. Yes, sir, in a lago for that to my doob, they go young, gullet, nine, cora, porinam, co sicar, boyon, cutty light, good young, good young, cutty light, hog young, corma, neama, bua, song, got your tune, half a man, loyal, tora, cano, tore, no, bistari, hammy, a corca, song, a bully, no, so negorti, sati, pile, hamro, bari, ma, ubina, mola, a crotti, rambro, lagino, of a sobby. आगने मैले बाचा गरे बाहिरे न निस्की कोठा बित्र सुतेर बसे बिस्तारे म पढाई तिर अगी बढे सुनने गर्थे उ अजे तेस्ते छ भन्ने एक दिन न सान कुसको भाई म संग रुन लाग्यो मेरो मन मा भिन्न प्रश्न हरु उठन थाल्यो उ अगिल्लो रात अस्पताल मा बित्यो रे म माथि आकाश खस्यो म बेहोसिए न होलो संज्ञा छ तर म तर तेरो सम्झना यो मनमा छ साथ छोड्ने छैन भन्थ्यौ कहिले तर साथी निकै we win a person of her coat or coat too much. If you never started out with cigarettes, so too much. Said Hamro do steep on it. Eltami sal, hunt your tail, mero sat, hamro, and all the sal, hunt your hard pony, jeet, jeet, party hard, hunt your carbe war, hunt your some pun, a suki party war, hunt you, to cause to come at some way, row into your hands, hunt you, thought of more that you buy the sorry bats into your lanu talk, in doggy, do it in conasso, to tarigo is thought of eight in more pony out to Santo Sundor, San Sar, Matu Badal Parico. जितनु भन्दा ठुलो कुरो हिम्मत नहार्नु हो त्यसैले लड्दै छु संघर्ष गर्दै छु त कस्तो छ साथी म सन्चै छु तेरो याद आयो अनि सम्झेर बस्दै छु हामी फेरि भेट छौ भनी दिन गन्दै छु अ न होलो संज्ञा छ तर म तर तेरो सम्झना यो मनमा छ साथ छोड्ने छैन भन्थ्यौ कहिले तर साथी निकै एक्लो छु अहिले न होलो संज्ञा छ तर म तर I 
I was able to find an English translation for the song, so I'm gonna leave a link to that in the description below as well as in the comments. So um, if you don't speak Nepalese, you can go over and check that out and read through it so you know what he's saying. Um, I listened to the song first though before I read it. I could definitely tell, I mean, just hearing it, you can tell there's a lot of emotion in what he is saying and as well as in the visuals because they really do typic the story extremely well. Knowing the lyrics, I'm like, that is exactly what was shown to me in this video. Um, and I think that that is just truly beautiful how they were able to put that together and have this really great little organic, like it has this home movie feel to it. Very sad to hear this knowing that he would then later, um, his song I believe came out in 2011. So yeah, it came out in 2011. And so just about six years later, he would indeed um, commit suicide. Um, you can hear that he definitely has some sadness um, in these chorus, and I mean how he said it, um, as well as reading through the lyrics here. Um, you can see that there is um, some sadness in what he's saying, and I think it's beautiful how he was able to translate it into this very great song that I really enjoyed listening to. Um, the beat of it was gorgeous. I loved the music in the background, and it also had a, such a great flow with everything he said. The whole song just went together seamlessly, his transitions between the chorus and the verses, it all just, it was it had a perfect flow to it. And I mean, everything just was really well done. You can tell that he had a lot of talent. Like, I mean, here you can see in the hook at the end, so it's like, what is there to take? Life is two days memory. You went leaving me, but I'll join you one day. In that peace and beautiful world beyond those clouds, not losing hope far greater than victory. That's why I'm fighting, struggling. How are you, my friend? I'm fine. Your memories flashed back, so I'm remembering you. I'm counting on days, hoping that we'll meet again. I don't know if it, how based on true events it is, but it seems like um, the best friend passed away. Um, I mean, that they say that he did. And, wow, I knew it was an emotional song. You could tell by the way he was saying it, but I didn't expect it to be quite this emotional. Um, I would definitely recommend reading these lyrics if you don't know Nepalese, um, even if you didn't really necessarily care for the song. The lyrics are extremely well written and they tell a very beautiful story um, in this just like less than four minutes. They tell a complete beautiful story about two best friends in their journey and their struggles that they went through. From what I've read about him, a lot of his songs have to do with some really real problems like in the world and faced by the Nepalese society. As it says here, um, in some places there's like a lot of poverty, drug addiction, homelessness, sex trafficking, um, and a lot of his songs, like, so this one talks, of course, a lot about drug addiction, um, cause that it, it seems as how his friend passed away. He also has ones about, like, relationships, um, between people, like his song called Amma, which means mother, and Didi, which means sister, um, and so he has a lot of really beautiful songs. I definitely want to take a look at more of them. I don't know if I'll do Amal's reactions, or I might just listen to them on my own. Um, but this was a really, really beautiful song. I love the poetry and the lyrics, the storytelling that he did in both the visuals and the lyrics. Um, and also just the beat of it was gorgeous. You really have like, it makes you feel the music as it's going through. Um, and you know that there's definitely something emotional going on there and then reading the lyrics and knowing how emotional it is, it really just drives home that impact of the song and the video. There's a moment when they were crying and I believe it's around the time, because it literally says here um, in the verse, it says suddenly one day his brother started to cry with me. Many questions rose in my mind. He said that he passed away last night. The sky came crashing down on me. I passed out. And so just that, I mean, it's just a story. This is a story in a song. And it is told in a very beautiful way with his immense talent as a rapper. I mean, there's rappers who rap really fast and it's cool and I do enjoy, you know, it's really awesome to listen to and it's very impressive, but it's also extremely impressive just whenever they are able to have this great rhythm and flow to what they're saying. And he definitely has that ability perfectly. You can tell it just comes naturally to him, it seems. And he's just able to flow off this beautiful story in a great way that is very easy to listen to and fun to listen to, um, while also delivering a very important message. Just extremely well done all on all regards to this song. It showed you the exact story they were saying and I love the little flashbacks to them as a kid smoking the cigarette. So that's like their friendship started smoking the cigarette and then it slowly just evolved as they grew up into uh, drugs and that ended up being the death of his friend. And um, I don't know if this is again a true story based on something in his life or just something because it is, I mean, this is a story that is true for sadly so many people around the world. and. So I think that it was really impactful. Huge props to Yama Buddha for this absolutely gorgeous song and 
may he rest in peace while his music continues to live on. Alright, so that's all I have to say about the Sati music video by Yama Buddha. Thank you all so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed, feel free to hit that like button, subscribe, and I hope that you all are staying safe out there and have an absolutely amazing day. Bye!